Hi guys, it is Tuesday, January 25th, 2022. What we're going to read that we found on TASS, it has with the Russian news agency. What that says on China is demonstrating a full and adequate understanding of Russia's stance in the talks with the U.S. on security guarantees. Russian representative to China, Andrei Denisov, said at a press conference on Tuesday. The Russian involved noted that the no, no, excuse me, negotiation had just begun. They do not affect China in any way. China has nothing to do with it. Never, nevertheless, this is certainly a major event in international life, and our Chinese friends are closely following the development of the talks. Then they, then they sort of noted the Russian deployment pointed out that there were no hidden agenda in the consolation between Moscow and Washington, and the Russian side kept China updated on the progress of the talks. Our Chinese partners demonstrated a full and adequate understanding of Russia's position, positions. The and the envoy emphasized on December 17, 2021. The Russian Foreign Ministry released the proposal on security guarantees on the part of the U.S. and NATO. The consultation were on January 10 in Geneva, while a meeting of the NATO-Russia Council was held in held on January 12 in Brussels, and the OSCE Parliament Council met in Vienna on January 13. Hopefully, this almost quick paragraph. For this article, I'm going to put the link below. It was on the task.com. So if you have a question about what was the Russian ambassador to China, Andrei Demisov, what we can learn about from negotiation, write down in the comments below if you want to see something. Make sure to view always watch for sharings. Always subscribe to my channel. Click the bell to see all notifications about the new videos and the latest video. I'll see you next time. Later.